In this exercise, calculate the slope of the line passing through these given points. If the slope is undefined, so state, and then we'll indicate whether the line rises, falls, is horizontal or vertical. So that means we need to calculate the slope, where the slope equals the difference between our y values over the difference between our x values. So if I chose 4 as my first y value, then I'd have 4 minus a negative 2. And for x, I'd need to start with the negative 3 as my first x value and subtract the negative 5 from that. Remembering that subtraction is plus the opposite, I can change each of those to plus a positive. So that my slope is 4 plus 2 is 6 in the numerator, negative 3 plus 5 is 2 in the denominator, and this simplifies to 3. So my slope for this problem is 3. And then looking at this, a positive slope would represent a rise. So for this one, the slope rises, it will rise three units for every one unit it goes to the right.